Newly released surveillance videos show the chaotic scene that unfolded outside Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida, in February as a gunman opened fire in the hallways within. The footage, made public Wednesday by the Broward County Sheriff's Office, displays blurred images of students hurrying out of the school in the moments after the deadly shooting and police officers, with their guns drawn, scanning the grounds in search of the shooter. The recordings had been the subject of a months-long court battle between a coalition of media outlets and county officials. The media outlets, which included CNN, the South Florida Sun, Sentinel and the Miami Herald, had filed suit against the school board and Broward County Sheriff's Office in late February after they were denied access to the videos. The outlet said they hoped the recordings would shed more light on the immediate police response to the shooting. However, as CNN noted, the footage, taken from exterior cameras on campus and not inside the school building where the shooting took place, does not appear to reveal anything new about the massacre's immediate aftermath. Surveillance video released in March showed how Scott Peterson, the sheriff's deputy working at the school, stood outside as the shooting unfolded, but it didn't provide much detail beyond that. Yet it did prompt Parkland students and parents to sue the county, its sheriff and the school superintendent for severe psychological injury and trauma-related coverage more than half of U.S. states strengthened gun laws after Parkland shooting SB's honor three coaches killed in Parkland school massacre Parkland shooter's mother rebuffed warnings that he should not have guns, official download.